Yeah. I, uh, well, one of the things I noticed is how on the upper left, uh, there's um, figure, there's four or five figures that are coming, coming down and then uh, turning over towards the right. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. And, uh, and they're, they're really tight together. And then below them, there are, there's that brown figure and the two, the two dark figures below that brown figure. And then the, um, the, the red figure with the open end, that's the purple figure. The one above it is what I call red. Yeah. Yeah. And then that figure on the bottom right, which has some really nice, interesting uh, things inside of it. Mm -hmm. Yes, this one does too. And that, and that one does too. Yeah. yeah, those two figures kind of, they seem to go together. They're like a pair in a way because of the colors and yeah. Where they each have a, a blowout on them. All of those figures down in the bottom right have at least three of them. And all the ones along the bottom have a blown out space. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All of them, yeah. Yeah, the blue one. Um, <clears throat> So that uh, so that something's going on down in that bottom third of the painting that's really different from what's going on in the upper left third. Do you see the difference there? Yeah. And uh, so that difference this creates is... it creates a drama. Yeah. Like there, there's some kind of uh, interaction between those two areas. Yeah, this is the top. So that it seems like those figures down on the bottom and on the right side are, uh, they're, they're like uh, independent actors. They're, they each have sort of a, a space to themselves where they're expressing something of themselves. Mm -hmm. And the resources, I thought of those shapes on the upper left that are coming down, they're like resources that feed or nurture those figures down below. Mm -hmm. Okay. A teacher, or it could be food. Yeah. Or any kind of guidance. Yeah, some kind of energy or um, encouragement or support. They all look a little enlightened from the tendrils around their heads or around. Yeah. Uh -huh. I think this is really interesting right here. Yeah. What do you see about that? Yeah, really different. I don't know. Yeah. It looks like it's um, being held in that space. Yeah. Not so much, much a hole, but a, uh, an object that's sitting in that space. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get closer to this bottom one when we talk about it. Yeah. Yeah. When you get close to that, you can see better the 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 um, round space in the middle of that one that has the tendrils coming out of it. 
Yeah, that, it's like a stem coming out of it here. Yeah. Yeah, has a little, looks a little bit like an eye. Uh-huh. I think I have it at the largest. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, unless you, um, did you open it up as a separate picture? No, I just did plus. Yeah. Shift plus. Yeah. Do you want it any bigger than this? No, that's fine. I can, I can stretch it out separately from what you're seeing. I like the, the two colors in this. Actually, is slate brown, cream colored, and dark brown, and then this shade of green that's really different. Yeah. And they're all blended. Yeah. And this is a really interesting right here where it gets cut off, but I guess that's a loop going down behind there that we can't see it. Yeah, I it's think it is. Again. And. I don't know how you did that because if you went down, it would have come over this. That's mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe you started at this end. I did. I started up there. Yeah, that would have worked. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> then I twisted the brush. Yeah. You did some good twisties. Yeah. And this one, you said you thought it was clinging to that uh, ribbon. Yeah. Yeah, it's like it's sitting on that. Yeah. This one's really interesting. Yeah, I like that. Looks like a person running. Yeah, I thought too. And I love the head here. Yeah. This conch shell, or whatever you want to call it, is, um, seems like a real peaceful center to the whole thing. And it's mm -hmm. neutral. It's not like these. And it's not like these. Yeah. It's something all its own, and it's also very calm. Yeah, um, I see that. Yeah, that that calm, the calmness of that figure, maybe maybe a resource for the ones up in the upper left coming down too. Oh. And because that might be the, the center, the central resource mm -hmm. that holds all of those things together. Mm -hmm. okay. What do you think of this one, the brown? Yeah. It looks like um, <clears throat> um, some kind of a garment <clears throat> with the open face and the neck wrapped around the figure, <clears throat> almost like a baby in uh, a blanket. First thing I thought of was a monk's robe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And this one looks like it's right up in there and the resources are going right into him. Uh -huh. He's getting the resources. Yeah. Yeah. 
you know, that, that figure looks more like a mother figure with those little or smaller figures down below, the two black ones and the purple one. Yeah. And even the, even the uh, pink one are related to that. Mm -hmm.